What's up guys, Shane Starnes here with Droid Monitor X. This is my Epic Gaming Desk setup for 2017. Let's go ahead and get started. You can't quite have an Epic Gaming Desk setup without an Epic Desk. I've chosen to go with the Smart Desk 2 by Autonomous. The main reason that I like this desk is the fact that I can raise it and actually do my work standing up. This is also one of the highest quality sit-stand desks that I could find at the price point. They start at $299. They can support up to 300 pounds, so you can put all the monitors that you want or as large of a computer as you want on the desk. It will be able to hold all the weight. And it also has two motors on the desk making lifting and lowering the desk super easy. There's also an LCD control panel which allows you to easily raise and lower the desk. The desk is also able to remember five different settings. I also decided to add the cable management system to this desk which is one of the best decisions I could have made. The cable management system with this desk comprises of a tray that sits below the desk. That tray can house a full power strip as well as all the power blocks to all your devices. It also comes with plenty of 3M wire holders that you can just stick to the top of the desk. I also purchased some zip ties to really tidy everything up. This is the perfect cable management system for my need. The next thing you're going to need to make your desk setup epic is some epic lighting. I tried both LifeX and Philips Hue and ultimately I decided to go with LifeX lighting. The main reason why is because it's just easier to connect to. It has an application that automatically connects with your lights. There's no need for a smart hub like what you have with the Philips Hue. Also notice that with the LifeX lights, whether it be the strip lights or the bulb lights, the lights were much brighter than what I got with the Philips Hue. So for this particular setup, I went with LifeX lighting. The Z light strip by LifeX provides the perfect amount of ambient light behind my display. And then I also used one of their bulbs uh, behind the computer itself. The LifeX lighting just adds a little bit of extra pizzazz to your setup. You can't quite have an epic gaming PC setup without an epic gaming PC. Now in a perfect world, we would all have the skill set and time required to build our very own custom perfect gaming PC. However, we don't all have the time or the skill set to do so. The best pre-built gaming PC on the market has to be the HP Omen X. The configuration that HP sent me for review is spec'd out to the max. It includes a Core i7 KB Lake processor, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and two GeForce GTX 1080s ran in SLI. As far as storage is concerned, it includes a two terabyte hard disk drive and 256 gigabytes of SSD storage. The standout feature here has to be the giant cube case, which is tilted on its side for easy access to internals. Everything about this computer is super user friendly. It even comes with a toolkit that's hidden away in case you need to make any upgrades to your PC. Performance on this PC has been absolutely insane. No matter what I throw at it from Battlefield 1 to Battlefront 2 and even quite a bit of Rocket League, I've not seen any lag or stuttering and that's with the settings at max. Not only does it perform well, but you don't have to worry about any throttling due to overheating because of the revolutionary thermal design. The tri-chamber design separates the GPUs, hard drives, and power supply into three unique chambers for optimal thermal performance. The top-mounted exhaust vents use physics to their advantage. As hot air rises, the stand lifts the tower, helping cool air to pull through and rise out of the vents. The best thing about this PC is that it's just so easy to customize you can add up to 64 gigabytes of memory. You got massive storage options with four storage bays capable of holding three terabytes each. And when it comes to IO, there are no shortage of ports. HP was also nice enough to send out the Omen 32 inch QHD gaming monitor, which includes AMD FreeSync technology. I like the fact that it is a QHD monitor instead of a full HD monitor as it includes 77% more pixels than a standard full HD display. The 5 millisecond response time and 75 hertz refresh rate eliminates all smearing and motion blur, giving you the best possible gaming experience. The included AMD FreeSync works by synchronizing the refresh rate with your GPU, this means that you'll never experience display stutter input lag or screen tears. Of course, the display is able to get super bright and colors look awesome on this display. HP also provided the Omen peripherals, which really rounds out the Omen X experience. The mouse features 12,000 DPI, blue mechanical switches offer next level responsiveness, and a 50 million keystroke lifespan. No matter how many keys you press at once, all key presses are detected. The keys are backlit with LEDs, which prevents miskeying, and when you're not gaming, typing on this keyboard is one of the most comfortable experiences. 
Of course, no Epic Gaming PC setup is complete without an excellent set of monitor speakers. The main reason that I had to have this Bluetooth monitor setup is the fact that it's Bluetooth. The speakers don't require extra wires being routed over to your PC as they connect with a Bluetooth connection. This helps with wire management. The sound coming from these monitors is absolutely insane for the price point of only $199. The speakers are only as large as they have to be to pound out incredible sound. They're smaller than some other premium speakers on the market, meaning they're gonna take up less of that precious desktop real estate. I also really happen to like the gold on black design. It's another thing that really drove me to these speakers. Lastly, every setup needs a little bit of customization. I found that customization in the AC Worldwide helmet speaker. They have the Master Chief speaker, which is the one that I have here on my desk. They also have Star Wars speakers, so you can get Darth Vader, Stormtroopers, or C-3PO. Now this also doubles as a Bluetooth speaker, and I've tested out the sound on the speaker itself. The speaker really does sound pretty excellent, but for my purposes with this setup, it is mainly just a decoration piece. Of course, I had to represent my Florida State Seminoles, so I grabbed the NEMA football helmet speaker. Once again, it is mostly just for customization and looks, but it has a Bluetooth speaker built in, which sounds pretty good for the small size. This is my Epic Gaming Desk setup, and it is perfect for what I need in a gaming desk setup. I'd like to do more of these in the future. Let me know what is required for your perfect gaming desk PC setup. That about wraps it up for this video. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next 